Hello, and welcome to ShipU Stats. In this video, we're going to go over how to compute a variable in JASP. In previous videos, we've computed a variable by either shifting the scale of measure or recoding a variable so that it's reverse coded. In this video, we're going to add multiple variables together to create a new composite variable. To do this, we're going to go ahead and click on Add Computed Variable, and then we'll go ahead and create a name. The scale of measure we're working with is the Bex Depression Inventory, and so I'm going to go ahead and call this Depression. Again, this will be a scale variable, and we'll be using JASP's native calculator to do this. We'll click on Create Column, and then we'll come to this calculator here. Once we're here, we can start to add our variables together. The variables we'll be working with are the variables that we shifted in previous videos. And we can just go ahead and add those together to create our composite variable. You'll notice that as I'm adding these together, JASP has started adding a number of parentheses to sort of signify the order in which it's going to be doing these things. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video here so I can go ahead and add these up. All right, now we've added all of our variables together, and all of the variables that make up this composite are now inputted into this calculator. We can now go ahead and click on Compute Column. And when we do that, we can scroll over down here at the bottom, and we'll see all of our depression scores populated into this new variable. That's how you compute a variable in JASP. Thanks for watching.